Hey guys, today's video is going to be an Ulta haul. Um, I had to go to Ulta the other day um, to replace the makeup that was stolen. It's so sad. Um, but whatever, you gotta deal with it. So, I'm gonna show you guys what I got real quick. It's not that much. Um, when I was there, there was, I guess, like, Stila reps or whatever. They, like, you know, promote their makeup or whatever. I don't really know. So they talked me into a bunch of crap that I really didn't need, but whatever. Um, I'm gonna go over what I went there for first, which was the product that was stolen, is the Urban Decay Naked Basics palette. Um, you know, everyone knows what it looks like. Um, mine was stolen, so I had to get a new one. I use this thing for everything, everyday makeup. Um, love this, so I definitely needed to go buy that. Um, I can take the package to you guys have seen it. Okay, and then the stuff that I didn't go there for <laughs> um, is the rest of what's in this bag. Um, the Jet, Jet, Jack Black uh, Intense Therapy Lip Balm in Shea Butter, SPF 25. I've heard a lot of good things about this. Um, this thing is seven freaking dollars. Look at this. How much do you get? How much? 0.25 ounces. Um, but I have it on right now and you just use it real little bit so it's gonna last a while. Um, but I really like it so far. I've heard a lot of really good things about this. So, yes. The Jack Black Tense Therapy Lip Balm in Shea Butter. So yay for me. Okay, this is the crap I got talked into. I was looking at getting, um, the Urban Decay Naked 2 palette, I think. And the Stila rep talked me into this. This is the Stila... Um, in the light palette, looks like this. Take out a box. It's got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten shadows, and it comes with a waterproof eyeliner as well. And it also comes with a little uh, like instruction manual on the inside. And I really, I mean, I haven't, I've used this once, and I really like it so far. So this is the instruction manual. Just gives you some ideas for looks. Blah blah blah. Um, it flips open like this, a little plastic sheet. Okay, so it is magnetized here. Um, it's really slim, compact. I like that. Um, it comes with a mirror. And then these are the shadows here. I don't know if it's picking up true to color because the lighting is kind of crappy. But whatever. Um, eyeshadows are huge. What does it say how much? Product 10 eyeshadows. Apply wet or dry. Oh, they're 0.49 ounces. I'm guessing that's per thing. I don't know. They're huge though. This was $38 and then it comes with a um, smudge stick waterproof eyeliner in Damsel which is a brown um, retractable eyeliner. Just looks like that. Haven't used that yet. Um, but I really like this so far. I've only used one, used one of the eyeshadows which is Kitten. Kitten? 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 Is this one right here? This is the most talked about Stila eyeshadow. Love it so far. That's the only one I've used. Um, great pigmentation so far, just on that one. I'll show you guys a swatch. Um, I don't know if you're gonna be able to see. There we go. It's really pretty, just like a all over the lid color. Um, I really like that so far. They blend out really easily, and it they're nice. So I'm really excited about this one. I still might get the um, Naked Two palette. I'm not sure yet. So I like that. I like that. Oh, and I was also going to get the, um, the chocolate bar palette, but the Stila Woman talked me out of that one too, which figures, but whatever. So, I'll go back and they're not there and get it. Get it in the plastic. Okay. Then the next thing they talked me into, suckers, is the Stila All Stay All Day 10-in-1 HD Beauty Balm with SPF 30 in it. This looks like this. This is supposed to be like an adjustable one. Um, you can adjust like any skin tone. So that's what it looks like there. It's coming off really yellow. It's not yellow. Um, I forget how much this was. Let's see. What does it say? Apply to clean skin. Use alone or follow with Stila foundation or tinted moisturizer. Um, I really like this. I wear this by itself and I just don't want to wear any makeup. Can you guys see it? Um, it's water resistant for 80 minutes, which I really liked as well. So that's you guys can tell. It really does adjust to your skin tone. Um, like it came off kind of yellow when I first pulled it on and now it's like you can barely even tell. Um, 
The only thing I don't like is the smell. It smells so bad. Um, but once it like sets on your skin and like dries, um, it goes to like a matte finish, which is really nice. And then the smell kind of goes away. So I don't really, you, you know, mind. But when you first apply it and it's still damp and it, you know, takes a second to set, it does have a goofy smell. I don't even know how to describe it. It just has a goofy smell. Okay, the last two things were gifts with purchase of the Stila products. Um, this is the Stila Sparkle Waterproof Liquid Eyeliner in Spectrum, I'm guessing. Just looks like this. I don't know if you can tell it's brown. It is brown. Um, highly sparkly. Brush isn't bad. But oh, maybe it's not brown. Maybe it is black. I don't know. It's actually really, really pretty. I don't know if you guys can see how much sparkle is in it. Oh, no. No. You can't. This lighting is horrible today. I apologize. There you go. You see it? It comes off kind of black and then it's really, really glittery. Um, but that was free with purchase, so I'm not really complaining. Oh. And then the next thing is the Stila Lip Gloss in... Da, 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 da. I don't even know how to pronounce that. Can you guys see it? B-A-L-L-A-D. Um, just one of their twist up ones. I like this so far. I did try this on as soon as I left the store. Um, I do like this. It's not sticky or anything. The only thing I don't like is that it's a twist up. And every time I twist it up, I get like a crap ton of product. It sucks. Okay, I think that's good. Yeah, see, like, I'm not even here. Just want to show you. Does anyone else have problems with these things? I guess that crappy swatch is gonna have to do. It's a really um like light pink color. I don't know if you guys could even see. Um, I really like it. Like I said, it's not sticky and it was free with purchase, so why the hell not? Alright, that is all I got at Ulta. Um, if you guys have gone to Ulta lately and you guys got any products, go ahead and leave them down below. I'm excited to see what you guys um have got. And if you guys have tried any of the products that I have um, bought, make sure you let me know. If anyone's tried this, let me know what you think. Um, if it's water resistant, please let me know. That would be nice. Not that I'm going to plan on going to water with it. Um, but if you sweat, I guess that is nice. And if you guys have any comments or anything, go ahead and leave them down below. And I'll look forward to reading them. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!